So, you've decided a camper van's for you, but are you going to find it comfortable? What's it going to be like to live with day to day? Is it going to be good to sleep in? Is it going to be good to eat in? What's it going to be like to drive round in? Um, maybe you're six foot nine and you wonder if you'll squeeze onto the bed. Maybe you feel the cold or you get hot easily. Is it going to be just like sleeping in a car? Um, these are some of the questions we get asked a lot. Let me have a go at answering them. Now, these vehicles, everything we sell here at Sussex Camper Vans, I can only speak for us, is something you could park pretty much anywhere you can park a car. And actually, they're a lot easier than some cars to drive. Uh, lots of folk come and say, oh, I'd like to test drive one. I'm just not sure if I'm gonna be able to do it. Will I be able to park it in Sainsbury's? Uh, will I be able to get it on my drive? Um, our longest vehicle, the, the long wheelbase, is about 5.2 meters, uh, and that will fit pretty much in any standard parking space, I find. Don't shoot me down in flames if you found a space it won't go in. Um, Width-wise, generally just under two meters. Uh, again, should slot into most places. Of course, everything nowadays has got power steering, uh, power braking, a very light gear shift, uh, very easy and comfortable to drive. So. Uh, we found everyone from the biggest bloke to the littlest lady uh, and everyone in between really uh, without exception everyone says when they have a test drive wow that's really easy and often people exclaim that's better than my car to drive certainly for the for the really newest vehicles it, it really is true um what about sleeping in it how long is the bed i hear you cry uh, well we've had customers who are up in in the six foot plus uh, region absolutely uh, and on our Manhattan and Caledonia type vehicles particularly, there's no restriction on the length of the bed, there's no stop at the end, uh, and we've got the ability to customise things here as well uh, and bespoke things to make provision whatever size you are. Our Paradise Twin layout has got lots of room uh, for rolling about, lots of space. Uh, it's got a king size width bed which takes up the whole width of the vehicle. Uh, that's a great one to look at as well. Will you be warm enough? Will you be cosy? Uh, well, we do everything we can to help with that. Of course, we can fit heating on board if you want it, uh, or you can plug in an electric heater if you're going to stay on campsites. We insulate the vehicle as much as possible, and we trim all the insides of the panels, so you're not looking at any bare metal, no cold spots. Uh, we fit curtains that have rails top and bottom and clip onto the sides so they close off all the drafts and they're fully blacking out. So really, everything you can to give you a good night's sleep. But is it good sleep? Well. I slept in our vehicles and I can tell you uh, I've slept really well and no one has ever yet said uh, one of our beds is uncomfortable. Uh, we use a high grade upholstery foam for the mattress which is very supportive and we can incorporate memory foam as well if somebody wants. It's completely flat which is really really important uh, and very supportive for folk who have slightly dicky backs. Um, I always find I sleep really well uh, without drafts with good support. Um, my tip is uh, go for a hybrid solution between a sleeping bag and a fully made up bed. I like a sleeping bag underneath and my duvet from home on top and don't forget a good pillow. So if you're wondering if a camper van would be comfortable for you or not, I hope I've answered the question. Of course, please come and see us, bring your sleeping bag, bring your own pillow and have a lie on some of ours. Why not? I'll make you the tea. Uh, see if it feels comfortable to you. Hope it helps. See you soon.